So compensation is a really uh, huge topic for most business owners. They, they love it, they want to talk about it, they want to make use of it, but it's the thing that I find is most misunderstood and, and misused by business owners as a, as a tool for growing their business. And it's because uh, you know, business owners kind of relate to compensation, they relate to money, the business is successful, they make more money, so they, they kind of have that connection. And so they feel that it's a tool they can use to kind of bend or shift the behavior of their employees. And I, I think you hit on something very, very important, and that is that uh, employees, yes, the paycheck is important, we all need to be paid. Mm -hmm. However, um, why people work for an organization goes much, much deeper than that, right? Absolutely. They want to be tied into the organization as a whole, but if you use compensation um, as a management tool, it can be exceptionally effective. So as much as possible, if it's going to be effective, you want a person's compensation to be tied to the work that they do for the company. You want that connection to be as clear and as obvious as possible, which is of course one of the reasons that we, we make use of performance objectives as we've talked about before. Uh, these kind of uh, strategies help an employee know if they're doing a good job and then of course if they're doing a good job, hopefully they're fairly compensated for it and they can kind of see a connection. And there's different uh, ways that we can make that happen. I guess we'll talk about a few of them today. But it's really all about making sure that, that the employee understands that the money that they're getting paid is has a, some kind of direct connection to the work they do and if they work harder and they do a better job that there's an opportunity for them to to reap rewards of that. Mm -hmm.